Hey Cancers, welcome back to my channel. I'm here to do your September weekly message. This is going to be for the 23rd through the 29th. So let's see what the fortune has in store for you. Ooh, look what came out. The Seven of Pentacles reversed. Someone's not so happy at work. You could sit there bored thinking to yourself, is this really what I'm going to do for the rest of my life? Do I want to make a change? I am bored. I'm tired of the same routine. I'm just tired of it. Oh, three of swords. You could be thinking about someone or something that broke your heart. You're heartbroken. You're depressed. You see the same thing and the same people for the past, I don't know how many years, and you're just over it. I feel like you're done. You're done. You've been thinking about it, and you're just like, when is this going to end? I have to make a change. This is depressing. I need to do something about it. This could also mean that you're that someone literally broke your heart and now you're just like, can't focus at work. Ooh, chariot reverse. This is your card, the sign of cancer. This is literally you uh, not being able to move forward. You feel like you're stuck in one thing or one person. You feel like you can't move forward, but I feel like that's just all in your head. You can you can change anything whenever the hell you want. Okay? And I feel like you're going to be realizing that this upcoming week. You're going to be looking at how things are, how that affects you, what changes you need to do or make. Knave of Cups. You see? There's another little, there's a little fishy in that cup already. There's already something that you have up your sleeve. Maybe there's a little something, something that you're already working on or towards. Or maybe someone will be offering you some kind of, you know, a small little offer to get you, you know, to smile again. Mm, I feel like it's just going to be like meh for you. But really, it's going to be meh. It's probably a boss that you can't stand either. If with the King of Pentacles reverse, oh here you want to leave work? Uh, here's a little raise, maybe a dollar or something. And you're just like, really? After all these years I've invested, you're gonna give me a dollar? Boy, bye. Girl, bye. Whatever. You're just tired of it. I feel like you're tired of it. <clears throat> Five of Cups reversed, okay? Whatever that was bothering you, I feel like you're over it. Yeah, you're over whatever some, you know, whatever was done is done. You're over anything that has to do with work, love, career. <sighs> Let's see. Queen of Wands reversed. I feel like you just don't have the energy or the motivation to move forward. Or to do something or to start something new. You just don't have the energy to deal with the same old, same old. Uh-oh. Oh, wow. We have two fives that came out. This is not good. Be careful avoiding conflict at work or those who uh, feed you or those who write you a check. We have the five of wands with the five of pentacles because, you know, arguments could come out. Something could be said that you don't really mean because you're fed up and tired or hurt about something. And you could be, you know, jobless or left out in the cold. Maybe there will be an argument or something that's going on at work or around your coworkers or someone that you work with, even at home. And all of a sudden you just get left out or you feel like you just need a break, a very long ass break. Either that or you're just, you say something you weren't supposed to and guess what? Boss is like, bye. Take a little something something with you and that's it. <laughs> what can my cancer, what's the end to this for my cancers? There has to be something good for my cancers, right? No, there is not. <laughs> I, we have the devil card here. With the devil, I feel that whatever it is that you were tied and bound to, maybe you have a contract, okay? Maybe this is a career and you have a contract and you just can't walk away or whatever that is. 
whatever you're bound to maybe you feel like you're bound to this and you just can't break away and it causes some kind of conflict or maybe there's just a lot of bad energy in your workforce and, and you're just you're just done and you feel like you just need to get away you need a break you just you feel lonely at times or you feel like no one gets you or you're not getting paid enough and I feel this week you're just going to you're going to open your eyes. You're going to want to make a huge change. This change is going to be for the best, but you're going to think about it and you're really really going to break yourself out of that mentality where you're like, "Okay, I can't move forward. I'm not going to have anything. I'm going to be poor if I leave this job or if I leave this career." But that's all in your head, okay? That's just the devil keeping you bound to the same old same old. Let's get an oracle for you. I saw secret admirer. Maybe you have a secret admirer at work. I don't know. Ooh, we have manifesting manifesting miracles. Your dream is soon to become reality. Trust your heart and continue to follow its guidance. What is it telling you to do? What is it telling you to do? Your inner intuition. Is it telling you to move on? Is it telling you to stay stuck? Or is it telling you to have faith in the universe and follow your instincts and something better will come? Yeah, literally you are manifesting something better, but you have to go through this fuckery in order for you to get to heaven, right? Sad but true. And you will be realizing this this upcoming week. <laughs> so I'm sorry, but yeah, something you know the after the storm comes a rainbow, so have faith, my love, have faith. All right, uh, Cancer, this was your weekly message. Please like, share, and subscribe to my channel. Be careful not to say something you're not supposed to or start some conflict. Maybe they're starting it with you and you're going to light a fire under somebody's ass or something. Whatever, to each their own, right? <laughs> I'll see you in your next video, guys.